Hi guys, it's Loretta. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I uh, I am in this magazine. <laughs> I'm so excited. I just wanted to um, uh, come on and uh, share my news with you. So uh, this is Crazy Quilt Quarterly. It comes out four times a year, as the name would suggest. And um, it's... If you hear something in the background, it's my grandson playing. <laughs> anyway, um, it's not available on newsstands. You have to order it online. And I think it's like a print-on-demand. So like if you order a copy of it, then they print the copy and mail it to you rather than printing up a bunch. And then if they don't sell, then you just have to recycle them. So this is much more earth-friendly. Anyway, uh, I think it's been going on, I don't know, five years, six years maybe, possibly even longer. Um, so, um, some of you may have seen my Dresden's, uh, my blinged up Dresden's crazy quilt. If you haven't, um, you can go and just go to my channel and look up all the videos. And it should be, it's one of my earlier videos. So, anyway, I did... Uh, crazy quilt which was six Dresden plate blocks and I just blinged them all up so I posted a video of it um, on one of the crazy quilt pages and uh, the editor for the magazine saw it and wanted to know if I would send her pictures to be in the magazine so here you go here's a little bio about me and my uh, Dresden Crazy Quilt. So yeah, I thought that was pretty exciting. My Crazy Quilt is actually in a magazine. <laughs> I'm super excited. Anyway, um, I did uh, another uh, winter snowman themed junk journal for the um, uh, Craft fair, that's what it's called, a craft fair. Um, I'll, I'll get there. <laughs> uh, that's coming up. And um, it's very much like the other one, but so I'll just do a real quick um, flip through here. It's one signature, and it has a lace on the spine and here, and yeah. So there's a tuck spot here. Here's another one of the um, altered paper clips using the um, cupcake things. Um, I got that idea from Kelly Snow, I believe it was. I don't know where she got it, <laughs> but that's where I got it. <laughs> if you take that off, you can pull this down. Lots of journaling spaces there. And the thing about these uh, junk journals, the one signature junk journals that I've made for the craft fair, is that there's just a ton of writing space. They're not, you know, they're kind of what I would call semi-naked. <laughs> so, I mean, maybe not completely, but some. It was kind of neat seeing, like, how many different ways I could use snowflakes. <laughs> but... And like I said, uh, I think I said this on the other video um, that I thought what really kind of popped on these particular uh, winter journals that I did was the pink. Just a touch of pink here and there. I made a little notepad here. I think it's like three sheets. And some lace and more stamping. So whenever I cut, whenever I would do like the punch for the snowflakes, I, you know, you'd have this leftover part. So I'm like, well, you can decorate with that just as much as you can with the actual punch out. So here's a guest check and some journaling paper. And this neat little tuck spot there. Some lace. I don't know if y'all can see any of that. Here's a bag. Another guest check. These uh, can be used on this side as well. So, um, and then the center, I took two plain envelopes and stamped them up. 
printed like that, and then there's journaling paper on each in each one. So yeah, very similar to the other one I made. It's made with the same papers and the same stamps and stuff. I just, some of the fold-outs and the tucks I did a little bit different than I did on the other one. Some index cards and journaling paper. This was a, a die cut that I bought probably 20 years ago. I mean, not the, I mean, the actual paper. I didn't buy the die cut. <laughs> Hey. This is Arctic. And a little belly band there made out of lace. And this I really, I thought this was kind of cute. So if you um, pull this up, all three of these open. So you can just, I don't know, you could put like phone numbers in there that you, you know, just don't want laying around or whatever. Passwords to computers, website pages, because <laughs> I have mine all written down. And then on the other side is that. And the last page is a, a small tuck with a tag that I made and some index cards. And there's the back. So yeah, very, very, very similar to the other one, just a little bit different. Oh, I gotta put this back in here. So, um, so yeah, so I apologize to everybody over not having um, the fifth crazy quilt block done. I know I'm supposed to be doing one a month, and I think I'm actually late on this one, but um, you can blame it all on this craft fair. <laughs> as soon as the craft fair is over, and I have Christmas presents done, um, I will get back to the crazy quilt. But anyway, um, oh, and I should be on sometime tomorrow. I got, um, I got tagged in the 10 crafty questions. I don't really have, I don't have, I, well, I can't really do it today because of my grandson. In fact, I can't believe he's actually in here in the other room this long <laughs> without coming in and, um, asking for something or, I don't know eating the dog food or, you know, whatever. So anyway, I have to run, <laughs> as you can tell. And um, I hope you guys have a great day and a great week. And I should be back on tomorrow or the next day with the 10 Crafty Question Challenge. And that's it. And thank you, everybody, who takes the time to hit like or leave a reply. Um, it helps with the Facebook algorithms. And um, it's really, I love the fact that you guys do that. And I'm thinking when I hit 200 subscribers, um, I'm going to have a giveaway. It'll be an international giveaway. So, um, yeah, that's all. All right, guys. See you later. Bye.